smells so strong and nice, you know, the flavor is out of this world. Every home, every home in Trinidad, Christmas, Christmas Day. Must have some fun, Chakrin. I am in no way, shape or form prepared to do this. Ho, 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 ho. Merry Christmas. Hi guys, so today I'm going to be attempting to make puncha cream. I, when I was younger, I used to make this with my daddy. So I feel like muscle memory should come into play somehow. But also I'm going to call him because I don't know what I'm doing. Hi father. Amen. I'm trying to make puncha cream. How do I make it? Let me see what is the formula. For every dozen eggs, you have to use six tins of condensed milk and two tins of evaporated milk. Let's get those things up there. Yes, Daddy. Important thing with the eggs is to beat it as light and fluffy as possible. The formula is a dozen eggs, six condensed milk, two evaporated milk. Okay. Keep the eggs as fluffy as possible with the with the lime skin to cut the freshness. You take out the lime skin, you add your milk, and you, you keep stirring. All right, so then you have the basic thing here. You add ground nutmeg, mm -hmm. a little bit, sprinkle it, and you add then bitters mm -hmm. and to taste. Okay, all right, good. I'll let you know how it goes. Okay. I have consulted with my father and it turns out I in fact do not have the right ingredients. I think six tins of condensed milk is simply too much. <laughs> simply too much. <laughs> and I only have two, so. <laughs> Let's start. So I've got Janai cutting up my lime thing. Let me tell you all what I need. This is chaotic already. Oh god. Let me start again. So, for all of y'all who don't know what puncha cream is, it's basically, I think of it as Trini eggnog, but much better. So, yeah, that's what we're gonna do. And the ingredients, condensed milk, Angostura bitters. I'm very shocked they have this in England here, but, you know, nutmeg. I mean, if you want, you could grate it up, but I was never doing that. Evaporated milk. The eggs, the limes, and rum, and rum, great. I don't have a hand mixer, so I'm going to have to use this whisk, which is probably going to take ages, but we're going to hope for the best. All right, let's go. So I'm going to just do six eggs because according to my father, I simply do not have enough ingredients for 12 eggs. Let go, let go, let go. Yeah. Thank you. Here we have our lime rind, right? Mm, yeah. Rind. Big up Janai in the back there. This kitchen is a mess, ignore that, okay? Yeah, thanks. Oh, no. I really said 12 eggs, yes? What do you think it is? For every 12 eggs. <laughs> <laughs> what am I doing with more than 12 eggs, too? But it's true. Now that I think about it, when I was younger and I used to make this for my daddy, this man used to have a whole bucket. Like, we literally used to be making a bucket of puncha cream. And it's funny because I don't think anybody in the house even really drank it like that. So I've got my six eggs and my, what do you call this? Lemon rind, lime rind. Shashaya has joined us in the kitchen. And now we're going to mix, mix, mix. Again, only have this whisk, so this is gonna be a while. I can't believe it's really cake mix. Look at the of this. So I don't eat cake mix because it has raw egg in it. But this is different, you know? The alcohol does kill it, the bacteria. My father emphasized the need for it to be very light and, light and fluffy, so... Disclaimer, don't whisk too aggressively. I met a mister. 
I introduced my friends to Trini Parang. <laughs> yeah, she That's got this. <laughs> she got this. See, I'm doing us proud, guys. Mm. You know this? Yeah, you do a good job. Let me show y'all. Y'all can't really see, and I'm afraid I throw it out. So I'm going to. Y'all think that's good? Yes, that's yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. That's what it looks like. And now, I don't remember but what the instructions were. Now we will add the evaporated milk after we stab it with the knife. Okay, two tons, two cans of evaporated milk. Time for some condensed milk now. How many know. girls does it take to use one. a can opener? One educated. <laughs> I did not use this can opener. <laughs> Should I call this dumb? You just put it here and then you close it. Simple. You twist. One tin of condensed milk. Yum. When I was younger, I used to eat condensed milk and biscuits. <laughs> the way in which I handle knives in this house apparently is scary. We may add a third can of condensed milk because again, according to my father, I need six cans for 12 eggs. All of the girls are leaving me today, well, all except Liv, because she's stuck here. What's next, rum? Punching. Um, Anything. Time to put the rum in. This is a vital part. Don't be shy with the hand. Seems shy to me. Let's wait, huh? Yeah, let's let's wait. Okay, maybe be shy with the hand. <laughs> She's potent. <laughs> <laughs> She's potent. Not Meg. As you can tell, I am using no measurements for these because it's really just however you feel, you know. I'm gonna stir a bit less. Mmm. Oh, let's smell this. Yes. Mmm. Yes. Love that. My father also said, do not be shy with this. I like to make mine brown. Well, not brown, but a, a dark cream. I'm very scared. What if it doesn't come all good? Drink a rum and a punch a cream. I drink a rum. Drink a rum and a punch a. Taste test time. <laughs> I love to use tears, tear cup. <laughs> Need much more alcohol. See, I tell you, don't be shy. Okay. <laughs> some more bitters. You also need some more, some more nutmeg. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Spice. Yeah. 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 You can't really see in it, but according to my taste tester, tastes great. Yes, yeah. yes. So, punch a gram of success. So, we'll definitely be doing this again. Alright, that's the end. Now I'm gonna bottle it out and whatnot. But thanks for joining me for another Vlogmas video. I will see you all tomorrow when I don't know what I'm doing tomorrow, but we're doing something. Like, comment, and subscribe. What she said. Make sure.